a smith number is a composite number whose sum of digit is equal to the sum of its digit of the prime factors okay so one example uh, is given here like 666 so there are three digits 6 6 and 6 sum is 18 and sum of its prime factors are the prime factors of 666 are 2 3 and 37 so the sum of the prime factors digits are 2 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 7 and that is also what 18 so hello and welcome to knowledge circle and today we are going to make a program based on smith number we will ask user to enter the number and we will check and we will display whether it is smith number or not so we have created the class let's double click on the class and let's start the program import java util scanner the very first line to take input then we'll create the class named smith scope of the class begins then main function after the main function the scope of the main function begins now we'll declare some variables here int n to take input from user num to store the value of n temporarily sod sum of digit and sopf to store the sum of the prime factors sum of the digits of the prime factors okay now we'll create the object of scanner class so that we can take input from user then after we'll provide a message to the user to give input okay after uh, giving this message we'll do what we'll take input from user the input statement has to be written by using the next entity method we'll take input from user so n equal to ob dot next entity now the next process is we will uh, just make a copy of n into the num so that uh, the value of num can be uh, reutilized now here we will run a while loop to find the sum of digit so while num is greater than 0 and it equal to num modulus n so that we can extract digit now sum of digit is equal to sum of digit plus d so in this way we get the sum of digit and the number will be divided here i forgot to just put the initial value 0 so let let's make them initially 0 sum of digit also and sum of prime factors also now number is divided by 10 loop gets closed now the sum of digit is done now it's time to find out the sum of digits of prime factors it's not the sum of prime factor it is sum of digit of prime factor so that's why i have run the loop for loop from 2 to number n up to n okay now we are looking for a prime factor means we are looking for a factor suppose if the number is divided by the current value of i then we will store the value of i in a temporary variable t and now again inside a for loop there will be a while loop so that we can find out the sum of the digit of that particular number if a number is of single digit no problem if it is of more than one digit then then also the sum of the digit will be calculated so again the code of uh, sum of digit is done here now when the while loop gets closes we will do what we'll divide the number by the current value of i so that already we have got that that's why we are dividing it by i and now to make the value of i unchanged we'll um, do it i minus minus now the work is done the loop will be closed at the end of this for loop what will happen will get the sum of the prime factors of digit it's time to compare them sum of digit and sum of the digit of the prime factors if both are equal then message will be it's a smith number if it is false the message will be it's not a smith number now we'll close the main and the class okay so let's see what is the error n n two time it has been mistyped i have removed it again recompile cannot find the variable t t is not declared just declare let's declare the t here now let's recompile no syntax error right click void main enter a number 94 it's a smith number let's uh, re-execute and let's enter another number 202 it's also a smith 